The Miles Wolf Cup Finals are underway. The best of five series for all the marbles in the American Association. I'm Carter Waneal, and it's time to bring you some highlights from a thrilling game one. Milwaukee taking on Fargo Moorhead from Franklin Field. The Milkman took the lead from the start in this game. First inning, that is Logan Trowbridge sending a line drive home run over that left field wall out in a hurry to make it 1-0 Milwaukee. His first in the playoffs, the Milkman would add another run on a ground ball in that inning, so it was two zip Milkman after one. Moving to the fourth, base is loaded for Will Kenger that's a base hit to center field. They would have trouble with this one in the outfield, and in the end, three runs would come in to score. He'd clear the bases. One of those runs of fired up Brian Torres, who's excited for Milwaukee. He was not done making highlights in this game. That made it 5-0 Milkman. The Milkman would add two more runs in the fifth, including this Jeremiah Burke's RBI single. Hector Sanchez would come in to score once that one finally landed on the turf, and it was 7-0 Milwaukee, and that was all in support of A.J. Shugel. Another brilliant start for the Milwaukee A6 score of a setting five hits, doesn't walk a batter, and strikes out seven. He has been outstanding in this postseason and making it look easy, getting the job done in front of his home fans in Franklin. And the Milkman would get some great defense behind him as well. Look at Brian Torres covering ground and making the grab in left center field. He just does that. And the Milkman would hang on from there. Miles Smith got the last eight outs on the mound, including that strikeout of Ben Lavorsi to finish it off in the ninth. And game one goes to the home team, the Milwaukee Milkman, 7-1, to one, the final score of this one. They take the first stanza of the Miles Wolf Cup Finals, and they will look to take a 2-0 lead on their home field today. It's a matinee for Game 2 as Fargo-Moorhead takes on Milwaukee. 1 o'clock first pitch, and then of course the series will head to Newman Outdoor Field in Fargo. Game 3 is Tuesday at 6.30, and if necessary, Games 4 and 5 are Wednesday and Thursday night also from Fargo. And you can watch every single one of those games at AABaseball.tv. We've also got them on Facebook Live and on Twitter, and Many other platforms as well will be keeping you updated. I'll also be in Fargo for games three and if necessary, four and five to bring the action straight to you. We are so, so excited for that. I'm Carter Waddeal for the American Association, where we play to win.